Hello everyone, Jay here. This is part two of the how-to series, um, and today's video is the katana. Um, I've started off with the giant butthole, as I call it. Um, just for a reference point for anywhere in the map, that is what I'm going to do throughout this whole how-to series, is use the butthole as a guide. Um, so we're at the butthole, um, and obviously facing the north mountain, and all you want to do is you want to face east. And you just want to head straight east. Um, like I said, you can either just listen to what I say, or follow the path that I take. You just want to head straight east, and to this, you'll find if you find when you're running east, you find this little river um, and this mountain. You kind of want to go up and over the mountain. You have to kind of go behind it; it gets confusing. But up there, and then straight here, and you should come across. Oh, I went really high there. You should come across my plane spawn right next to it. But you should come across this cannibal, this tiny little cannibal camp village thing. Um, and now this is the reference guide, so you want to go here, and then it's kind of hard. But just in the direction where there's no trees. You see there's trees there and there's trees there. You just kind of want to go straight where there's no trees. And um, you want to find a way down. You can shoot me down this, I'm sure, without taking damage. And keep going along here. And then you should see, yeah, here it is. Um, so let me try, let me replay that for you. So you go straight down in between the trees. Um, and just follow these rocks. Also, don't mind the random character around. My friend decided to tag along. Um... But so you just keep following these little hills, and you should see down here with the mossy rock, there is the entrance to the katana cave. So all you want to do is head straight down here, um, and then I'll get to it, get down here. And like I said on the last episode, oh my game, like sorry, as I said in the last episode, I'll turn the cave light on to make it easy to see. Okay, now that I'm down here, um, you're just gonna you, there's a bunch of loot here. You can loot it if you want. Now be aware when you get over this rope, there is gonna be an armsy and a couple of cannibals. So just keep that in mind. Um, so you want to head up this rope. You don't have to kill the armsy. I mean, you can if you want, but you don't have to because you can dodge him. The he is off to the right. He's down there. I'll just quick show you. He's down there. What you want to do when you come up this rope is you want to go left where the plank boards is. So you follow these plank boards down, all the way down. Um, and then if you keep going here, you should find a little pocket. You have to crouch. A little pocket. And you have found the katana. Here you go. Well done, you have just collected the katana, added another weapon to your collection. Um, there's also a briefcase of money, um, loot, food, trays, watches, cloth, everything. Um, there's a nice little fire there. But that was part two of the how-to series, you now own the katana. You've added now to your collection, you have the modern axe and the katana. Look at you go, you can kill any, any enemy and build any base. Um, I hope to bring much more of these katana, these how-to tutorials. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, um, and I'll see you next time. Bye.